music, art, and collaboration. You can experience it all at the first of its kind venue in the Highlands. The Monarch Music and Arts community is bringing local people together to encourage, promote, and support original music. WLKY's Madeline Carter gives us a first look at the venue and its impact on the local music scene. If you love supporting local music and art, check out this new spot here on Bardstown Road. It's called The Monarch, and it's more than just a music venue. It's a creative hub for original work to come to life right here in Louisville. There's a tremendous amount of musical talent in this city, and we want to make sure that we're giving them a space that they can be heard. Amplifying the sounds of local artists. The Monarch is a place for musicians like Indiana country singer Tyler Hood to create, collaborate, and perform. I'll come back for more. We have songwriters coming through these doors. We have singers. We have guitar players, drummers. <laughs> you name it. You could come to The Monarch and you can find what you're looking for uh, when it comes to music. It's not a bar or a restaurant. It's a nonprofit and a private membership community. We're not selling anything. What we're providing is a safe space, right? And um, to make this space sustainable, we'll rely upon our members and the generosity of our community. Whether you're a musician or just someone who loves to support local music, you can become a member and come and go as you please. Our musician and artist members will have access to artist rooms like this. So this is kind of a mixed-use room that will be partially a rehearsal space. It'll be a jam space. Every weekend, the venue hosts live shows from local and touring artists, bringing in performers from all across the country to grow and encourage Louisville's music scene. I've not seen a place like this around town. That's what makes it so cool. Now that this is here, I know it's going to spawn a whole new generation of talent. So I can't wait for that. Honey, hold on. I work till I'm dead of your mind. Madeline Carter, WLKY News.